Some people have questions about possible health effects from electromagnetic energy, or EME, coming from mobile phone base stations and other telecommunications facilities. This video looks at EME from mobile base stations and how it is regulated. Is EME from mobile base stations safe? Radio transmitters send and receive communications using radio waves for things such as radios, televisions and mobile phones. As we become more reliant on wireless technology, there are more of these transmitters and they become more noticeable. This includes transmitters for radio and TV and also transmitters for mobile networks, including for 5G and the National Broadband Network. Exposure to EME from mobile phone base stations and towers has no known health effect. How is EME regulated? The Australian Radiation Protection and Nuclear Safety Agency, or ARPANSA, is the independent Australian government agency which provides advice on the risk of exposure to EME. It has developed a public health standard for EME exposure. The ARPANSA standard sets exposure limits which incorporate wide safety margins that give full consideration to the many sources of EME present in the modern environment. Typically, exposure to EME from mobile phone base stations is a tiny percentage of the ARPANSA standard. As the regulator for the telecommunications sector, the Australian Communications and Media Authority plays an important role by enforcing telecommunications facilities compliance with the ARPANSA standard. Electromagnetic energy is all around us, including from natural sources, such as sunlight. Without it, we wouldn't have weather forecasting, radio and television, mobile phones, or wireless broadband services. EME exposure from radio waves has been the subject of detailed research by experts for many decades. Health authorities such as ARPANSA and the World Health Organization have assessed all of the evidence and concluded that there are no health effects from EME at levels below exposure standards. ARPANSA continually reviews the science to ensure public safety is maintained. More information on the science about EME and health can be found on the ARPANSA website. Information about compliance with the standards can be found on the ACMA website. <laughs>